What's up everybody, welcome back to Dad Does Videos. I'm coming at you today from one of the bathrooms in our house where one of these sinks is clogged, the drain is running really, really, really slowly. I used to walk through Home Depot and would make fun of this, the drain weasel. It's four bucks, it's a one-time use product, or at least two times because you have two attachments to it, but it does a really, really nice job of cleaning hair clogged drains. I'm gonna show you how to use it it takes no time at all. Okay, so let's get this thing ready to go. So from your package, take out the handle and one of the attachments. Now to get this thing ready, as you'll see here, there's a groove in the handle and then a groove in the attachment. What you simply want to do is pull up on the yellow part in the handle that opens up the area to then simply push your attachment in and then you slide the yellow part back down, but you wanna go all the way to the bottom and you'll hear it click. You're ready to go. Okay, so let's move forward and actually use the drain weasel. First step, as you can see, I've already taken care of it. You're gonna to wanna to get your stopper out of your sink to clear the area for you to do your magic. And you simply get your weasel ready, you put, the attachment down the sink and then you start twisting and what's nice about this tool is that it has on the last couple inches of it um, kind of a, a piece of material that likes to grab pieces of hair and other gunk in your drain and does a really nice job of it so we'll just keep twisting a while and sometimes you can feel a little bit of pressure on it. It means you're getting something. Sometimes I like to move it around up and down to make sure it's catching a lot of the different pieces and parts in the, uh, the drainage. And then once you've gotten to a point where you're, you think you're satisfied, you pull up and you can see that we've got a little bit of hair and other debris on the end. Okay, so don't let this fool you. Even though I've pulled up just what looks like a little bit of a, a clump of hair and debris on there, you gotta remember that this thing, while we're twisting it around, is picking up lots and lots of things and spinning it around itself pretty tightly. So there's probably a lot more on there than you think. We're gonna go ahead and turn the water on and make sure our drain is working well. As you can see, it doesn't appear that the drain is blocked anymore. So we'll count that as a success. Okay, so of course, when you get finished, you are gonna want to dispose of the grossness. Now, if this is the second time you're using this, you can just throw away the whole contraption because that was your second attachment. You're not gonna need this anymore. You're gonna have to buy the, the package again to use it. But if it's your first one, you're gonna wanna save the handle for the next time that you use it and you simply go in reverse of what we did when we got the handle ready. The only trick to this is that you want to make sure the, the yellow part is set up like that so that when you push up the, the space, this allows for the curve right here or else it's locked in. So we simply push up, this piece comes out, we toss it, and you're ready for the next time when you still have this ready. Thanks for watching.